Today I'm collaborating with Born Pretty and I'm going to show you how to use some of their nail art supplies. Hi and welcome back. And if you're new here, a warm welcome. So this is a collaboration with our friends over at Born Pretty. We're going to take you through some of their products like their extension gel, cat eye polish and their solid gel colors. And I'll get this unpacked and get started. This is their solid nail tips gel and you use this gel to attach a nail tip. I'm using a jelly tip for this. Before using it, you would prep the nail by lightly buffing off the shine and applying a base coat. It does take some practice to get the proper amount, so don't think you're going to get it perfect the first time. Like all nail supplies, you just have to keep using it to get used to how it works. Slowly press from the cuticle all the way down and then wipe off any excess before curing. And now you can treat it like any other extension. So I'm buffing off the shine, wiping away any dust, and that's ready for your design ideas. Now I'll show you how to use their solid nail gel. First prep with a base coat. and then finish with a top coat. Okay, so that's their solid cream gel. It's really fun to use. Next is the magnetic gel polish. So for a tip, when you're using this kind of polish, the best way to store it is upside down because those little magnetic glitters tend to sink to the bottom of the bottle a bit. Then mix it up for about 30 seconds. I'll show you how this looks on a gray base and a black base. So you can just play with a magnet to make cool designs. And remember, it doesn't cure until it's under the lamp, so you can take all the time you need. Here it is with the studio lights off and it's absolutely beautiful, so fun to play with. Here it is on black. Next is the Nail Tips Gel, and there's a few ways that you can use this. It's quite viscous and thick, so this type of gel is great for applying a nail tip. So prep your nail by removing any shine. 
and by the way, I'm not actually doing this to the practice hand, then apply a base coat. Then you take a bead of the gel, and then starting from the cuticle, press the nail tip down gently until the gel has moved down the nail. And this will take some practice, so if you don't get it right the first time, just start over. It might look easy here, but I did practice using this before filming. Feather out any excess. So then as you're holding it down gently, put it under the lamp to cure, and just follow their curing recommendations on their listings. And then let go and give it the full cure. If you have any extra that came out the bottom, you can use your e-file to smooth it out. And then another way you can use this nail tips gel is for rhinestone glue. Take a small amount, and then place the rhinestone, and then kind of feather out the gel so that you don't have any really hard edges. Then cure. If you found that you use too much, you can just file it down to make it smooth. Then finish with a top coat. Next is the extension nail gel, and you can use this to extend the nail. It's like a builder gel, but we want to show you a different way that you can use this also. So I have some glitter and nail decorations. So prep the nail and apply the gel polish color that you want for the base and cure. Then dab on some glitter here and there. Apply a light layer of the extension gel. And repeat and it's gonna make that glitter look like it just goes on forever in your nail this look is so pretty so you can do as many light layers as you like for the final layer I'm going to apply some UV glue and add on a moon and some stars and just a little bit more glitter next file the edges to make them smooth Apply a top coat, cure, and it's done. There's lots coming up, so please subscribe and ring the bell to be notified of new videos. And a special thanks to the Born Pretty team. It was really nice working with you. Have a great day, everyone.